Once upon a time, there was a ukulelean. He journeyed for many years to planet Earth in search of intelligent life forms. Upon entering the Earth's atmosphere, his spaceship landed on a slide in a school play yard. The ukulelean opened the hatch and was delighted by the rich oxygen that filled his tone hole. He knew he would need to master Earth language, so he looked for the nearest classroom and walked in and sat down in a desk that seemed to be waiting just for him. He strained with his four eyes and four ears to listen to the teacher. Not only was his language different, so was the way he looked. The children only had two ears and two eyes. He had four of both. Soon, he noticed the children pointing and laughing at him. He started crying. The teacher gave him the restroom pass and said he could go clean the tears off his face. While he was in the restroom, he looked at his ears. I know why they're laughing at me, he said. My ears are crooked. So he straightened his ears. There, he said, that's better. And he returned to the classroom. He sat down at his desk and looked around. Nobody seemed to notice. The teacher was teaching the math lesson and called on him to give an answer. Do you know the answer? The teacher asked. The ukulelean sighed and gave a try. I'm sorry, the teacher replied. That's not the answer I was looking for. Here, let me help you. She put his ears, the tuning pegs, back in the place where his strings would sound correct. There, she said, that's much better. The ukulelean learned that it didn't matter what his ears looked like. What mattered was that his strings sounded correct. And the students who laughed, well, they apologized. And they learned that when something is different, it's actually unique and special.